Hey guys, I'm Laura Risotto and welcome to the behind the scenes of my Metastage experience. Hey everybody, how's it going? Today is day one of our Metastage experience. Metastage is a volumetric video capture studio for virtual and augmented reality, as well as holographic experiences based here in Southern California. Metastage and I are doing a joint release of their phone app, which allows you to see live performances in augmented reality through your phone. I'll be releasing and performing my brand new single, One More Night, as well as my Eurovision song, Funny Girl, in a holographic show that you can watch through your phone from your own home. All thanks to the awesome capture technology that Metastage has developed. For those of you who are new to this technology, augmented reality, or AR, is a way for your phone to put 3D stuff in the world around you so you can see it through your phone. That means you can walk around them as if they were holograms and they stick to the world around you so it really feels like they're actually there. Obviously the performances in the app aren't something that anyone can just record with normal video, which is why we're gonna go to the Metastage studio and have 106 cameras capturing my performance from every angle. So today we're gonna head to the Metastage to do some test captures, try out some different wardrobes and hairstyles for the actual shoot date, and of course meet the awesome Metastage team. And then we're gonna come back for the actual shoot date and that's when the magic happens. Let's get going. So today's basically wardrobe test and also being able to understand the space we have because there is choreo to the songs we're recording. We have our selection of wardrobe. Brought a few things for Funny Girl, more on the red, dramatic diva concept. And then for one more night, I brought more colorful stuff because my new concept is a little more on the tropical side. I was told that I couldn't bring anything green because we're filming on a green screen. So that's a no. And because it's a new technology, there are certain limitations of what the camera can capture when it comes to textures and shine and stuff like that. So this is why the wardrobe test is so important. Within this eight feet, we can do up to three people at once, but today we're just doing you, so that's gonna be awesome. Well, you'll be standing where this octolith is standing. Oh this is where how... the rocket is. Yeah, exactly, exactly. This is how we blast off into space and also calibrate all of our cameras. When we're filming, it's only you. It's like only the performers in yeah. here, and everyone else sort of has to stay outside of the curtain. When we were building the stage with Magnopus, they were like, it's really important that we don't have any wiring on the ground. So you'll notice that all of our cabling and wiring feeds up through the towers and goes overhead. But there's really no like cutting and stitching together different shots. There's yeah. like one shot. It's yeah. really like a live performance. I love one take things. I'm so yeah. excited. We'd love to do is to test all of your outfits, all the wardrobe in our base safety lighting first. Okay. Then we'll go through each one and try more like experimental creative, that's, creative that's lighting. Fine. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Okay, okay cool. cool. So Adam, you just have to calibrate? Yep, I just need another seven minutes or so. Oh, cool. okay. And then we'll be ready to start. The first outfit we're gonna try out today is the one I wore for Eurovision when I was performing Funny Girl. It does have shine, so I don't know how that's gonna be captured, but this is my favorite, so we're gonna start and try it out. Let's go get ready. All right, this is outfit numero uno. So we just did our first test here at the Meta Stage with Funny Girl. There are cameras spread all around in nine different pillars. This one over here is the director's camera. We have a GoPro. If I have to think of what a front stage reference would be, this yeah. is it. But in reality, it's 360 video, so I get the chance to kind of like think of it as people in different pillars, and I can just look them in the eye or look in the eye of the camera. The next song is One More Night. It's my next single. And we have choreo to that. Choreo is not ready, don't judge my movements. So this is how much space we have that I need to keep in mind when we're moving, it's an eight foot diameter. Um, so basically from here to here. And then yeah, to the size, which I think is more than enough space. Look at oh. you! Oh, it's cute! <laughs> it looks good! Oh, it works! Hey guys, it's finally shoot day. We are here at Meta Stage to record Funny Girl and One More Night, my next single. For each song, we're doing different hairstyles and different light settings as well. Um, for Funny Girl, we're gonna do hair down like this. We're gonna do hair half up. We're gonna do a high braid 
and a bun. And for each hairstyle, we're doing three different lighting settings. Usually when I perform this song, it's a lot about hair flips. If you've seen me in Eurovision, you know I'm all about that. We have to be careful with the green screen with how that's captured. I just can't wait to um, get started. So what we're doing is we are testing our jewelry options to see what is and is not going to work within the volumetric space. A great example is something like this that stays away from the face. If this was a flat object, it would be fine. Mm -hmm. But you take something and you have it hanging separate from the body and thin items disappear. So you have something that will show and then will disappear. And when it disappears, it almost casts a light shadow that will either cast a weird shadow or we'll take like a chunk out mm -hmm. because the technology doesn't have something to grab onto. And what we have to do for the necklace is if it's flat against the body, it's fine. If it comes out, it's going to disappear. So I'm going to take very thin bits of top stick tape and we're going to sort of just lightly secure it so that you're able to move and it still looks natural, okay. but without it then swinging and disappearing. Yeah, and disappearing. We have an eight-foot capture circle that we're able to, uh, the actors are able to utilize every inch of, but when you go outside of the capture circle, there's just nothing pointed at that to get any data. You lose whatever part of the body goes outside of the capture area, so. She took a step back during part of the song and she, like, brought her hand, uh, like, in a wide sweeping, like, arc, and I, it, like, cut off, like, pretty much all of her wrist and arm. Mm -hmm. um, so, just for safety, we would like to get another one. Carolina, Stephanie, and I together are the Powerpuff Girls and the Totally Spies. All in one. Yeah. I'm here. Block Carolina. <laughs> insert, insert picture of Carolina here. Ta -da. Completely different vibe. <laughs> Can you see the rebranding? Can you tell? The outfit we're most excited about is a purple, this purple jacket here. But because it's a jacket and it moves around, um, it's a little bit uncertain. So we're gonna do a safety, a few safety takes with this outfit. This is the calibration rocket, which Carolina has now nicknamed Stud. And they put this big guy here in the middle in order to calibrate the new lights with the cameras and everything. Good rocket. Our lights are set up. Now you should leave. So we should let Stud choose strongest. Then you start doing that thing that I like. You know me well, yeah, you care. And get it right, my head is spinning. Or is it a sign to give it a try? Maybe one more night. Oh, baby, if you can't remind me what it feels like, give it one more night. Yeah, baby, take me, make me put all of myself aside. Maybe one more night. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had fun keeping up with our journey for recording this awesome project. If you want to see me performing as a hologram in your own home, remember to download the Metastage app. All of the info you need is in the description below. All of the songs in the experience, Funny Girl and One More Night are also available in all platforms, Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, you name it. So make sure to check them out. Also, if you're having fun with the captures, make sure to post them and tag me on social media so I can check them out and we can share this experience. I wanna know how much fun you're having. I had such a blast recording this. Thank you guys so much for watching, you freaking rock. I'm Laura Risotto and I'll see you next time.